Utah. Oh yeah. <laughs> One more time. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna sing a song for Reagan as I follow her down the road. We're gonna go wash our hair and clean out our vans because they nasty. As it sometimes happens when you don't clean them for a while and when you have big ass dogs running around, stinking up the place, getting their hair everywhere, everywhere. Oh, singing a song for Reagan. Decided that it was time to clean her van so I was like I should probably clean mine too and it was practically like Christmas because I found so many pairs of clean underwear I don't have to go do laundry for like another two weeks do you have any idea how amazing that is wherever you are be there for long Whatever you do, do it with love. Whoever you greet, greet them in love. Cause love is enough. It is enough to tear down the wall. Visions great or small to connect us one and all. Love is enough. So wherever you are, be there for love. Whatever you do, do it with love. Whoever you greet, greet them in love. Cause love is enough. Uh, I need a haircut. Reagan, you were supposed to cut my hair. <laughs> I'm starting to look like my dad. Well, I was I was driving yesterday. Uh Chloe's I think it's still up there. Yep, look. 
Chloe's gravy tag went flying across the dashboard. And I was like, what the hell? I don't know what she caught it on, but I just found this under my seat and her name tag was in the back somewhere. Like, I don't know what it got caught on, but I'm gonna need a new ring to put those back on her. And um, as we were taking our potty walk today, my shoe fell apart. The first trip I was like, whoa, I'm tripping. Second trip, my foot went through my shoe like that. And I was like, oh, my shoe's broke. <laughs> Which is cool. I've been looking at sandals. I need recommendations because choosing things like that, there's too many options too many options and that stresses me out so anybody have any good sandal recommendations I'm here for it hello it's me driving on the 76 and I'm trying to make it to the 80 so I can drive through Nebraska and avoid Kansas altogether. I don't want get to get pulled over and searched for drugs again. I don't have any, but they're gonna do it anyway because I look like a hippie. I think I missed, I messed it up. I stopped following the... <laughs> oh, me. Oh, me. <laughs> pulled over in Sterling at a rest stop that's supposed to have a dump station and I think it does but there's no hose so not gonna use it um, there's there's no water <laughs> there's no water spigot or anything so it's just a dump hole which seems weird so uh, I parked I took all the dogs out to use the bathroom and then it started getting really crazy windy. Then it rained, so I took a shower. And then it all stopped and it's really hot. So we're gonna keep moving for a little bit, see how long I can stand driving. We're gonna probably cross into Nebraska and see how far we can get on the 80. Long day. Long day. Second place I came to for a free dump station that I found on iOverlander that was not a thing. The one in Rifle, there was one, but it was fenced off. So, okay, Chloe, I'm gonna need you to get up so we can go a little bit more. Come on, let's go. Out of my seat. Beep, beep, toot, toot. Come on, out. Thank you. For a second there, I thought maybe I was imagining things and that it was just one of those like lights at the top of one of those towers that was flashing. But then I just saw like six arms. There's definitely lightning happening. There's lightning happening right where I'm going. Here we go again. Party. I hope. I hope it's not raining too hard so the dogs can go to the bathroom and then it can start raining hard after we get back in. Is that a fair deal? Is that a fair deal? Life? Fair deal? I guess? Okay. leech camper sales in Lincoln Nebraska and they do free RV dumps so I'm about to dump my RV for free in a couple hours I'm a little bit away away but I wanted to call make sure I was getting excited for a reason because I've already been to three places 
three. That said, they had free dumps on the internets, but you couldn't really call because they're like rest stops and stuff. First rest stop. Actually, I only went to two. I think I got, I think I looked at the uh, street parking. No, the other one, the satellite view. It didn't even look like a rest stop. It looked like a cafe where the location was. So I was like, I am not about to drive all over the place for a place that isn't even a rest stop. So first rest stop, the uh, dump station was crossed off, like fenced off. Next one didn't even try it because the overview didn't even look like what it was saying it was. And this last rest stop had a dump hole but did not have any sort of water hookup, so it would just, no go, no go. Yum, yum, yum. So, this time I found a place that is on my way to where I'm going, and I called them, and it confirmed. It's free. Leech Camper Sales, L-E-A-C-H, I think. I forgot again. E-A-C-H Camper Sales, yes, Lincoln, Nebraska free dump. Go get them some business or dump your dumps for free. 